Birds don't like cats, do they? Oh my god. Oh my god. So I noticed a turtle came out of hibernation. And I was like, man, I bet it's Luna. Because Luna likes chilling out over here, hibernating. Uh, I mean, in the summertime, she likes, you know, sleeping over here. And I was like, man, I bet you it's Luna. And I was going to go looking around the yard. And I was like, wait a minute. Why don't I just look under the stairs? Because she goes under the stairs all the, the damn time. That's her little pad. Sure enough, she's under the damn stairs. And I was right. It's Luna. That's Luna. It's not even April. It's kind of funny because Luna comes out early every damn year. They have certain characteristics. Uh, some of them come out early every year, and normally it's Luna first, and then Miss Herpetin. And then some of the other turtles will come out kind of later. That's Luna. See her orange beak? Well, I saw that big old gaping hole after I had been out here like 20 minutes. And I was like, okay, a turtle definitely got out of hibernation. And I already walked around the yard, and I didn't really see any turtles. And then I was like, I bet it's Luna. And I was like, I bet you she's under the stairs. And sure enough. Because, I mean, this is she, this is where she hangs out, you know, even in summertime and everything. I mean, she'll still go about the yard, but, you know, eight times out of ten, she's under the stairs. That's Luna. Luna, it's too early for you to come out of hibernation. You say, well, it was done spring on, on March, what, 20th? And it's the 25th. But I don't know, she could have even came out a, a week ago, and maybe I didn't notice. She could have came out a week ago or so and I maybe didn't notice that big old gaping hole because I had a this is the first time I really been coming out here you know like like as if it's spring which it is spring to linger around the yard because you know it had been so cold and crap so I just come out here for a few minutes and put the bird seat out um so this is the first time I kind of started walking around the yard I thought I saw a hole opening up a couple weeks ago over there somewhere, but the weeds could have grown over it. But that's Luna! That's Luna! And Luna, every year, she comes out early, early, early. Normal, normally not um, in March. I mean, normally early, early, early April. You know, but it's possible she could have came out the end of March, and I didn't notice it till early April or whatever. That's Luna! Well, I don't want to, uh, I would grab you, but I got to crawl under there. Well, I'll check on you a little later and I'll, I'll grab you out of there, okay? Pet you, okay, Luna? Okay, baby? She's like, man, I was so ready to come out of that damn hole. Shibba. Turtles, they don't have to get below. And then don't be getting bit by no damn brown clues. Don't be getting bit by a brown clues. Say his word. His brown, brown recluse fiddleback bite that uh held up already look oh he does have a little scar there but my uncle was like if turtles don't get below the freeze line they would still survive and it got to like negative 30 degrees in the winter time see that's not below the freeze line that's pretty deep you know the the mulch you know because of the mulch i mean it's pretty deep in there but that's still on you know level with the ground that's not below the freeze line some of them do get below the freeze line though like carmella likes to hibernate deep see luna hibernated pretty shallow i mean the mulch is kind of deep in there that's only see why it seems like it's deep because of the mulch and the mulch man it really does help them hibernate big time doesn't it simba see here's the top of the ground that's not deep down in the ground. That's just deep down in the mulch. Ain't it, Simba? See? She hibernated like that. That's not below the freeze line. They look, they still survive. And it got to negative 30 freaking three degrees. Got negative 33 degrees, Hannah. And Luna still survived. Because Luna... Gives you a big stud, aren't you? Big stud. Damn big stud. She's got dirt all over her. Got dirt all over your ass in. Luna. Luna. You got
guys aren't hungry yet, are you? I can't believe little Dewey's out. I didn't see him come out. I don't know where his little hole is. Where'd you come out, Dewey? I don't see your hole. I don't see your hole, little guy. That's little Dewey. He must have came out this morning. Did you come out this morning, Dewey? Cutie pie. Two turtles out. Two turtles. Not even April yet. Miss Ripperton's on her way out. But I grabbed her and took her out. And my baby not ready to come out yet. No, you no. Not ready to come out yet. She look, she's not even ready to come out yet, are you, baby? But say I almost I almost am. Say I almost am. This is kind of funny, but Luna, Dewey, and Miss Ripperton, they're always the first ones out. Either early April or March, which I don't know if that's just coincidental or what, because they're the first turtles that I had that I got first, and then the other ones, you know, years later or every year later, because it was Miss Herpeton and Reptilio, and then a couple weeks later, it was like I got Luna, and then a week after that, Dewey. And, De and Dewey came out on Sunday. Luna came out on uh, on Saturday, but she could have came out a little earlier, and I just didn't notice it. But it's kind of funny because they're always the first ones out. Oh, there you go, baby. I'm trying to put you back in here, baby. Okay, is that okay? I see she's not even ready to come out. Okay, well I'm gonna try to cover you up, baby, and see how they always. Um, they end up hibernating uh, at an angle, but first. Wait, hold on. Ass first. That's her face and that's her ass at an angle. Ass first. But at first, you know, they may not be quite like that. When they, you know, go in their little hole, but eventually over the months, they turn around ass first. And they come out at an angle. See? Don't you! Don't you miss her, button. And you're always the first out. You or Luna and then Dewey. And that is just kind of weird and funny. Okay, well, but it's going to be 80 degrees soon. Oh, there, a lot of turtles are going to be popping out in the 80s. It's going to be 80 on Monday. Okay, little fella. There you go, boy. She ain't quite ready. Come out here. I don't know where Dewey is because he moved. And I don't know where he went. It could be under there. These damn weeds, man. I love these weeds, man. But I don't remember these being that bushy last year, man. Especially not like that. Look at that. I think it's freaking cool, though. I'm not mowing anytime soon. Maybe in about a month, a month and a half. Because so I like looking at all my flowers turtles are coming out like flies that's uh charlotta just stuck her head out that's diego and that's damien damien i'm gonna give you guys a banana okay but i don't think you're gonna eat quite yet i'm sure there's more out somewhere uh, Miss Herpeton's out somewhere, but I didn't see her, but I know she came out because the hole's empty and then uh, Luna and Dewey are still out. They came out two weeks ago. Reptilia! Dude, my turtles are popping out like flies. You guys popping out like flies. Popping out like flies, Reptilia. Just popping out like flies. Look at all you guys coming out before April. You guys are supposed to come out in April, not March. This is your mommy, Miss Herpeton. Well, she was uh, ready to come out. Um, when was it? Uh, crap, I can't remember. A day or two ago. 
and uh today she finally came out she came out of her hole i put her back in there because i knew she was still sleeping real hardcore when i found her hole opening up uh, a bunch of other turtles came out today three more turtles came out and miss Rep i mean reptilia too so five uh came out today but miss Repton was about to come out yesterday i think it was i can't believe reptilia came out so now there's like one two seven turtles out already seven turtles out um she is let's see march april uh she's 60 she's officially seven years old little reptilia she's not done growing she's seven years old and you're not done growing reptilia you is not done growing i wonder if you'll eat something but she'll keep growing. She'll probably get as big as Carmella or her mommy. But that's her mommy, Miss Herpeton. But she's still kind of groggy, but not, you know, we kill you. But let's see, uh, Dewey, Dewey and Luna came out a week ago. Luna could have came out a week before that. And then it was a couple days ago, I noticed she was trying to come out are about to come out and t oh yeah it was today she came out because it got so warm um but she was she was ready i mean about to come out a couple days ago but she wasn't ready to come out yet because it was still cold or cool or whatever and then um today i saw diego they all came out or those three came out at the same time diego over there diego uh charletta and damien and I did not know Reptilia was out until a second ago, until I went over there by the fence and I saw my baby. Because see, I have that yellow right there. It's, she's real easy to spot when you see that yellow right there. That yellow. Oh, Reptilia, you get that from your daddy because daddy Reptilio had a little yellow and orange on him. You get that from daddy and she's such a pig. She'll probably eat right now. The other turtles probably aren't going to eat for a few more days. But Reptilia, I wouldn't be surprised. See, you can tell Miss Herpeton is still groggy. But Reptilia, she's still all wide awake and shit. So I, I'm going to try to see if she'll eat some. But I mean, I don't know if she will. I'm going to go get some Reptiman sticks. See if she'll eat some Reptiman sticks. Look, she's eating the damn Reptiman sticks. Yeah, see, she's not going to eat no Reptiman sticks. Because she's not, she's not ready to eat the Reptiman sticks. Look at Simba eating all the Reptiman sticks. But Reptilia, she's not ready. She's still trying to wake up. See, I was in another dimension for six damn months. What you expect? See, what you expect? So it's going to be, you know, a few days, maybe even a week or longer before she starts eating. Reptilia! I miss you so much! She'd buy. She loves reptim and sticks. She loves, hey baby, look, she loves these reptim and sticks. That's um, Trixie, I think. To overfill the pool and get it real clean. Trixie did that. I guess it was probably her that laid eggs in the tub. Man, I put Miss uh, Herpeton right there, and she looked like she was out of it, sleeping, but they're not dumb. They know when you move them around. So she moved probably back over there, because that's where she wanted to be. You guys are so funny. But that's getting clean, but there's still some crap on the bottom. Try to get that out. But yeah, so I think it was... Luna, uh, not Luna, uh, Trixie plopped some eggs down. It was probably Trixie because she was out there, you know, that was her hole. It's probably Trixie and God damn it, who did that? Um, she plopped down about four eggs, but I forgot, um, when you take that up, there's a big section and like, like three of them went down the damn drain, two or three, but I know she laid at least four. Uh. Oh, look, it dropped again. It didn't even break. This actually dropped all the way, you know, 24 inches, and it didn't even crack. 
I dropped it in the tub and didn't even crack. Because you say God made these to be flexible. Or Satan, if you believe God is Satan. Oh my God, that's so cold. Why is that so cold? My God. Well, this fell in the water, so it's warm because the water is a little bit warm. Damn, why is that so cold? I don't know. Shit, it's cold as heck. But the eggs are kind of cool. Hey, Dim's turtle eggs, Simba.